and in this video we're going to be using Onshape to create ISO number 9. Uh, to do this, uh, we're going to make the overall cube shape. Uh, then we're going to use a new tool called a fillet on the edge, and we'll just cut out the circular portion here as well. Uh, so let's get to Onshape and start creating ISO number 9. So create a document, name it ISO 9, and hit enter. Uh, when the workspace loads, we're just going to start a sketch and we're going to go back to the front plane for this one. I'm going to change to my front view and then if we look at the overall object, it's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 long and a total of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 tall. Uh, so we just have to do our rectangle, start on that origin, and click and just type in my 9, hit enter, and then 6 and hit enter. Uh, then I hit, can hit my green check. I'm going to click on that top corner of my view cube so you can see what's going on. And we're going to extrude it out. If we go back to our object, we can see it's going to be a distance of 1, 2, 3, and 4. Uh, so we come back and change that to depth to 4. And hit enter. Uh, green check is going to create that shape for us. Uh, first thing I'll do is just round off this edge. So if we look back, it's got a rounded edge here on the left-hand side. Uh, so we want to make that rounded edge. So we're going to come up here on the top and find the tool, the tool called a fillet. We're going to click on that tool. We're going to click on the edge that we want rounded, which is this top left. And then we need the distance. So if we look, it gives you the center point and it, it tells you it's one, two from the edge if we count one, two from the edge. Uh, so it's two from the edge, so that tells us our radius is two, and we can hit enter and it cuts it in that radius of two. Green check accepts that change. Uh, then the last thing we're going to do is we're just going to make a circle. You could also use a whole tool, but we're going to use circle and sketch a circle in on this case. Uh, so I'm going to sketch. I'm going to just put it on the front plane and then change my view to the front. And then I'm going to use a circle tool. I want a center point circle this time. I'm going to start on that right hand corner. So I start on that upper right hand corner. When it indicates I'm on that upper right hand corner, I click. And if we look at our image, if we come back down and look, you can see it's got a diameter, uh, a, a radius of 1, 2, 3 left. So it started at 6. 6 minus 3 gives us 3. So it gives us a radius of 3. So I'm going to click. And it's shown us, if we look, it gives us the diameter. Uh, symbol so you can just change that three that radius to a diameter of six three times two gives us six and enter. If you wanted to you could change it to radius It's probably easier just to keep it as a diameter uh, We hit our green check to accept that shape and then finally we have to do an extrude remove or extrude cut So extrude I'm going to click in the shape and then I'm going to click remove and I wanted to remove all of it, so I'm going to change where it says blind to through all. If we click on our top corner of the cube, you can see it's cutting it out. Hit our green check, and you can see it gives us ISO number 9. Hopefully this helps in your creation of ISO number 9. Good luck!